DK Raiders, beginning to read one. Let's play football. Today was Eric's first day at football training. Eric put on his football boots. He strapped his shin guards to his lower legs. Then he pulled his socks over his shin guards. Eric was ready for football training to begin. Shin guards. Welcome, said the coach to the players. Together, you'll learn how to play football. He told them three rules: play your best, play fair, and play without using your hands or arms, unless you are the goalie. Goalie. First, we have to warm up," said the coach. "This will get our muscles ready." Everyone did jumping jacks. They jumped with their legs and arms apart, and then together. Afterwards, they all jogged on the spot. Muscle. Next, the coach led the players in stretches. Stretching will help to stop us from getting hurt, he said. Hold each stretch for ten seconds. My muscles feel ready," said Eric. "Good," said the coach. "Then it's time to learn some football skills." Passing means kicking the ball to another player in your team," said the coach. "It's the best way to move the ball to the goal." You have to kick with the inside or the outside of your foot. Eric, Beth, and Henry passed the ball to each other. Good passes, everyone," said the coach. In a game, you should only pass to a player who is free to take the ball. Let's try running with the ball. Said the coach. This is called dribbling. The coach dribbled around some cones. To dribble, you have to move the ball with the tops of your feet. Said the coach. Now you try. Eric started dribbling around the cones. Keep your head up, said the coach, so that you can see both the ball. And the pitch. Eric tried looking up and dribbling. Dribbling is hard work, he said. Cones. Let's shoot some goals, said the coach. The players kicked the ball at the goal one by one. Eric tried and missed. Keep your eye on the ball and aim for a corner of the goal, said the coach. Eric tried again and scored goal. Remember, said the coach, the team that scores the most goals wins. But it's more important to try your best and have fun. Now let's have a water break and then play a game of football, said the coach. He split the group into two teams. Whistle! The coach blew a whistle to start the game. Henry kicked the ball from the center of the pitch, and passed it to Eric. Eric dribbled the ball, and passed it to Beth. Beth kicked the ball into the goal. Super teamwork! Said the coach. The score is one zero. Said the coach, and it's the yellow team's turn to kick off. The game went on. The players passed and dribbled the ball up and down the pitch. The coach blew a long whistle to end the game. Eric's team cheered. They had won. 
Everyone shook hands. Good game, said Eric to the players in the yellow team. The coach talked about the game while the players cooled down. Are there any questions? Asked the coach. When's our next training? Asked Eric. Next week, said the coach. Until then, remember to practice your skills at home.